Hey guys, it's Chris Ball with Turvis Athletics, and we're going to talk a little bit about what to do right after a rain. Eastern North Carolina this week, we've had about six inches of rain. All of our fields are underwater, soaking wet. Sometimes you have to take really, really small steps to get your field playable. Right now, what we do, if we're going to play, if we're going to try to play tonight, we're going to let all the puddles and all the standing water go down as far as possible. As soon, as soon as we reach a point where the sun comes out, we start to get some heat and a little bit of wind, then we're going to take our rake and we're going to open it one way. And you can see what I've done. I'm going one way with this rake, just one way, and, and almost cutting it open. So we're leaving the channel for the wind and the air and the sun to get in there to start to dry our clay out. Once we reach a certain point, we're going to take our, our turfus, our calcine, a little process we like to call chicken feed. So we're going to have these, these dry channels open and we're just going to brush material just like that from a bucket or your bag onto these areas. That way you're getting uniform coverage. You're not taking a bag and dumping it in the same spot and having to drag it and move all that material everywhere. Once we, once we have this done, we'll come back, rake it again, repeat the process if necessary, and drag it out. That's your quick tip for the day.